Oh, no, you got to throw him. Come on. Come on, Hexy. Come on, Hex. What are you doing? Yeah, he's mad. How do you think I feel? F***ing God. Every day. New York Yankee Saints, yet again it is Felix from NYNews.com, the one and only NYNews.com. Yankees fans, remember early in the season when Aaron Hicks said he was a 30 for 30 guy? <laughs> More like 10 for 10 or 5 for 5 if he gets lucky. This guy is making about $10 million per season, straight up robbing the Yankees. Signed till 2026. No wonder he signed that extension. Aaron Hicks should be at the prime of his career. Hicks, his best season 2018, you call it so-so, but he's never blossomed into that player that supposedly Brian Cashman thought he was getting when he traded for him, that trade uh, with the Twins. Come on here. Let's look at his stats thus far in 2022. A 38-year-old in Brett Gardner will be putting up better numbers thus far. Oh my god, look at the, look at those stats. Ridiculous. An average of 196 with 97 at bats, right? Runs 12. You would think he's a speedster guy, but he's basically I don't know, he's not a power guy. He's not a speed guy. What is this guy? A <laughs> nothing guy, right? Hits 19, doubles 1, 1 home run, RBI 7, walks 18, a baby toddler playing t-ball puts up better numbers than Aaron Hicks. An 80 year old grandpa would put up better numbers than Aaron Hicks. This guy is considered a professional ball player. And I know the naysayers talk about Gallo, but at least with Gallo, you know what you're getting when it comes to him. The only thing that Aaron Hicks is hitting is Tiger Woods' niece. Or whatever his wife is to Tiger Woods. That's the only thing he's hitting. Because he's been blah for the Yankees ever since we got him. Like I said, he bloomed at a little bit in 2018. And for some reason, this guy has simps on Twitter. You say anything remotely negative about Aaron Hicks, you're going to have the Aaron Hicks Twitter brigade come at you, which is uh, comical. I don't understand that. The guy's trash. Here, let's uh, read a new article by the New York Post. Hicks was back in center field, hitting six, a day after leading off, as the Yankees tried to get him right at the plate. <laughs> Good luck with that. Hicks said he was frustrated by his play this season. He went hitless in four at-bats and struck out three times in the 9-6 loss to the Orioles to extend his slump to 2 for 37 with just a pair of extra base hits all year. Hicks struck out with the bases loaded in the 6th, and again with a runner on 1st in the 8th. Following his final at-bat, Hicks slammed his helmet and bat to the ground. <laughs> this guy's better at uh, golf than baseball. He's now 3 for 23 on the season with runners in scoring position. Look, out of the three errands, Aaron Hicks ain't that Aaron. At least Aaron Boone has some balls this season. We all know Aaron Judge is an MVP candidate. Aaron Hicks, though? Aaron Hicks? Yeah, I, I think you need a career change, buddy. Here's what you do. Give uh, Aaron Hicks' spot to a uh, youngster in the farm, specifically somebody like Floriel, Flo Rida. You know, Aaron Hicks, uh, your time's up, buddy. You've gained a couple of pounds. You look sluggish. I'm going to say this again. You hitting coach, 
Same old Aaron Hicks. Dylan Lawson is the man, by the way. He has done an incredible job with this offense. So Yankee fans, what do you guys think? Like always, leave your opinions in the comment section below. Does Aaron Hicks have to go? What do you do with that contract? He does have a team-friendly contract, but you must be on crack if you decide to take that contract as Aaron Hicks is playing like the local neighborhood softball team that gets together every Sunday and gets hammered off of beers. Yet again, Yankees fans, this has been Felix from LYNews.com. If you're enjoying the content, I appreciate even the views. But I'll appreciate it more if you hit that new thanks button. I'll check you out next time. Before it hits